take the sex with someone that you're not in love with like that. That's how I started to catch feelings. Oh, and then he said he was bragging about how he was busting all in your ass and your mouth and stuff. He never bust my butt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's something serious, though. That's something that you need to look into because I pray that's not the case. But say if it was the case and you're sitting around there like everything's okay. What if he he does have it? It's still, I don't, it's still human to me. I don't think I'm not going to tell him about what he has. Oh. Okay. So how do you feel right now? Um, I don't know. I just feel like I've been betrayed. You feel betrayed? If Tay was to come to you today and tom or tomorrow and apologize to you and wanted to make up, would you do it? No. No. He wants a free HIV apartment like all the gays. That's not cool. Let me ask you a question. What did you like about Tay so much that made you leave from where you at to go to his house, go back home, go back to his house, go back home, go back to his not house? No what did you like about what did you like about Tay so much? It's, I don't know. It's, I like the Tay's not ugly. Not, um, I just like that he was so sweet and he's just different from the other girl I date with. Like, I feel like mm -hmm. I don't know. I feel like when I was mad and he was like, "Oh, I want Sprite," and I said no, and he still gave me my Sprite. And when I was gonna pay with my food, he's like, "I got you, babe." So. Like it seems like you're not used to that type of treatment because you keep bragging about that, about no, a sprite used, that you no, can no, right? I'm used, no, I'm used to niggas buying me shit, like, you know, niggas spent money on me and shit, but, like, I just like that, the fact that he, like, cares when I'm mad or if I'm, you know, he just, he think about me, like, think about me, like, you know. So let me ask you a question. You kept bragging about that Tay gave you four hundred dollars. Tay, we all know that Tay done made over five hundred, done made over a thousand, close to two thousand dollars. You're telling me since you've been there, you only received four hundred dollars giving up. Asking, I, 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 I was, that's just an estimate. But I, I never asked him for him. No. He, he, just, he just gave it to me. That's what I like about him. Like he just, I didn't have to ask him shit. Like. I don't know. But it's echo. I'm going to stop it down real quick. But it's just like, I like that he was like sweet and kind. But I give me my moment. I make money. I have $9,000 in the bank right now. So what do you mean? So, um, yeah, that's what I liked about him a little bit. I was catching the feeling when he smiled. It made me, it made me smile. Like, you know, I ain't trying to brag or nothing, but like, when he was working at McDonald's, and then I was like, pretty much like, hey, you can make more money than that. You know, do your raffles. And I look at him. He got his car fixed. <laughs> his sister said, his sister said that she likes me. Because remember, he was just gonna get kicked out. To his, he was just gonna get kicked out the apartment. But she changed her mind. So like I said, I feel like I was just making him like, I was like telling like, I coming down a lot. Like when he was going to fight, when, um, once you, when he was going to fight that, um, that boy on Facebook, I was like, babe, calm down. Like it, your, your life is not worth $60, lose, lose your life over $60. Like just take that as a, as a, take this as like a lesson learned. And don't fight mine because the the guy said he had a gun for him. Yeah, he he gave my money back. He gave it right back to me, bitch. So, um, yeah, that's what I liked about him. Like I said, I never bought I never bought a nigga anything ever. Like only thing I bought a nigga my ex boyfriend food, but I never spent no clothes on no money on no niggas clothes. I never spent no like you know nothing on no nigga. So like, I felt like I was catching feelings for him. He had a coat that I just ripped up. 
I ain't use him. I just, I just seemed to come mad. Like I said, if we had sex, I just feel like that sex was uh, coming through. I'm just mad. I don't want no views. I'm just, I liked him. He just different. It's hurt my feelings, that's all. Like, it's like when you're, like, talking to your nigga, you're talking to me, like, why are you not talking to me? But he'd rather get on live than talk to you. No, you guys call. I turn my shit up because I don't want it. I don't want to think about him. I'm, I'm over him. I want no apology. I want nothing. No, don't leave me alone. And this is less up to me. Like, stop. You know?